The main obstacle that we face in creating an everlasting battery has been overcome, and the EV revolution is now in full force. Currently valued at $730 billion, Tesla has launched its Texas Gigafactory in April of this year. Earlier this year, Lucid unveiled its first vehicle with 500 plus miles of range. Rivian's IPO in November 2021 will be the largest since Meta's IPO in 2011. And now, every major manufacturer, from Ford to GM to Volkswagen, is investing billions of dollars in electric vehicles. In fact, this new age of mobility is off to a flying start. But here's the deal. We can expect the EV revolution to take off unless we develop stronger batteries. Yes, batteries. Batteries have long been the primary power source. Phones in electric vehicles run on electricity, and laptops can function without batteries. However, although batteries are necessary to keep everything running, they also prevent electric cars from performing as effectively as they can. Now, batteries are a necessary component of nearly every piece of modern electronic equipment, such as cell phones, computers, vehicles, and watches. And these devices cannot operate at their full potential because of a faulty battery. However, the good news is that a revolutionary battery technology is being developed that will revolutionize the entire planet. And to learn more about this groundbreaking battery breakthrough, make sure to watch till the end of this video. Hey, what's up guys? It's good to see you back for another video. And before we start, make sure to like and subscribe. And let's get to it. So why does it take so long for your phone to charge up to 100% capacity? Why does your laptop die so quickly when it's not plugged in? And why can't you go hundreds of miles on a single charge in your electric car? You see, the batteries in these devices just won't allow it. And because of this, we'll have to go all the way back to basic battery chemistry to figure out why. So an anode, a cathode, and an electrolyte make up a battery. Ions move between the cathode and anode via the electrolyte in batteries. And the liquid battery chemistry is the foundation of conventional lithium-ion batteries, which are presently the dominating technology. To put it another way, a liquid electrolyte solution connects the solid cathode and anode. For years, these batteries have been doing their best work. However, because of the physical limits of a liquid electrolyte, they are already at their maximum density in terms of energy cells. Now, liquid can only be limitedly compressed, and these batteries are limited in size and capacity. And we're now at the point where we can no longer go any farther. Conventional lithium-ion batteries, on the other hand, would never be able to recharge your phone in a matter of minutes, and there's no way that they'll be able to keep your laptop running for days or power your electric automobile to run for thousands of kilometers. So if we want our smartphones, watches, and electric vehicles to last longer and charge faster, we definitely need a new battery technology. Fortunately, the startup Quantum Scape has brought the forever battery closer to our doorstep. This previously unheard of startup has developed a groundbreaking technical approach that will make solid-state computing a reality for the first time, and this business has the potential to alter the course of human history. Moreover, it will probably result in substantial profits for shareholders. Now, several prospective startups have made substantial technological progress in producing practical and functional solid-state batteries during the past several years. But QuantumScape is the only one that has effectively fixed the issue. QuantumScape has found a way to cut the cost of solid-state batteries and eliminate the dendrite problem. Additionally, the business has used a battery cell design that does not need an anodized surface. QuantumScape's total battery prices are now 17% cheaper than typical lithium-ion batteries because of the elimination of anode production cost. In addition, the organization has devised a more efficient way of obtaining its raw materials. And this should enable scalable and cost-effective production of solid-state batteries. It also opens the door for electric cars to take over the transportation industry by making them much more affordable and easy to produce. Now, as early as this year, QuantumScape claims to be able to provide Volkswagen, its largest shareholder, with A-samples or early prototype battery cells. 
By the end of 2023, it expects to create a pre-production line and supply ASSBs or all-solid-state batteries to Volkswagen for use in a test car that will be ready in 2024 or 2025 depending on the manufacturer's timeline. It also wants to have solid-state batteries departing its first gigafactory by then. Now there are three advantages to solid-state batteries for the millions of prospective EV customers in the US in the next several years. It's greater driving range, faster recharging, and safer chemistry. And nearly 10% of all new cars sold in 2021 were electric vehicles, with Q4 EV sales up 72% year over year. However, despite this boom, the battery technology powering all those electric motors still trails behind what is achievable with gas-fueled internal combustion engines. So a ceramic electrolyte is being used in some of QuantumScape's batteries. Now this material was chosen for its superior performance to avoid dendrite formation, which can occur when lithium ions accumulate on the anode of the battery through repeated charging and stalactites formed from these reactions are highly flammable and can result in a power outage or fire. Even though QuantumScape's ASSB utilizes lithium in its development, the business claims dendrites pose no concern. And because solid electrolytes are generally non-flammable, battery manufacturers say that ASSBs are safer than regular batteries. The time it takes to refill is one area where ASSB still have a long way to go before they can overcome combustion engines. And to charge from 10% to 80%, QuantumScape claims it will only take 15 minutes. This is compared to the 5 to 7 minutes it takes to fill a standard car at the pump. The advancements in solid-state battery chemistry technology are not exaggerated. It's a real thing. And yes, it's actually occurring at the moment. And in the following years, this technology will profoundly impact the electric vehicle sector. And it will alter the electronic industry for the foreseeable future. Now, solid-state battery manufacturers will be among the most successful companies on the stock market in the coming decade. And one of those big winners will definitely be QuantumScape. However, it won't be the only one since this is the beginning of a tremendous shift in the energy sector. So do you think QuantumScape has changed the game for the battery and EV sectors? Let me know what you think in the comments section below and let's talk about it. This brings us to the end of today's video. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel and make sure you hit the notification bell so as to stay updated on the latest news about the EV industry. Enjoy your day and I'll see you in the next video. If you love our content, check out this others. Thanks for watching.